Tottenham midfielder Rodrigo Bentanco was stretched off during the 1,1 draw with Leicester on Monday night after suffering a horrific injury. Related articles Related articles Tottenham boss Ange Postacoglu has given an update on the condition of Rodrigo Bentanco after the midfielder suffered a horrific injury in their 1,1 draw with Leicester. Bentanker came off much worse in a 50,50 aerial challenge with Abdul Fatou inside the Leicester City box, although there was no indication it would have been a penalty. The Uruguayan had to be given oxygen and was stretched off by medical staff, who rushed to his aid after being knocked unconscious. It was later confirmed by Spurs team doctor that Bentanker was sitting up and talking following his concussion substitution. And Postacoglu admitted details were scarce about the 27 year, Ole's health beyond what the team doctor had said during the game. I haven't spoken to him, with a head injury you have to be careful, Postacogla told Sky Sports after the game. The good news is he was up and talking. He'll let the medical team catch up with it. Postacoglu later added in his post-match press conference, yeah. Look I don't have a lot of information but I know he is up and he's communicating so he's fine. From that point of view, the incident overshadowed a lively contest at the King Power, where Spurs had dominated the first half with ten attempts on goal. Pedro Porro headed home across from James Madison, who was booed on his return to Leicester, but the visitors squandered several chances to put the game to bed. That was crucial as Jamie Vardy brought the hosts back into the game in the 57th minute with a header at the far post. Both sides had chances to win it, with debutant Dominic Solimp denied by Mads Hermansen and Guglielmo Vicario pulling off a fine stop late on to keep out Wilfred and Didi. A frustrated Postacoglu made no attempt to hide his fury with his attacking players after throwing two points away with some sloppy finishing. Disappointing night for us. First, half excellent and control the game but wasteful in front of goal. Second half was the same. We started off well and once Leicester scored, the crowd lifted and we lost our composure, Postacoglu added. It was an issue we had last year as well, we need to keep working hard and be a bit more ruthless in front of goal. At times we made poor decisions. When we are that dominant we should be out of sight. We do everything to score goals and we didn't score. The dominance is great but if you don't score it is meaningless. We have to be stronger in our mindset in the front third. To be that wasteful tonight is disappointing. We just weren't clinical.